Five weeks from weigh-ins. Today's a scheduled deload week, right? Today's a scheduled deload week. So that'll bring us to like what? Four weeks of a taper into the fight. Yep. Uh, so we've been, we've been, this is like our, I don't know. 38 what, weeks. Six, no, like probably six or seven, four week block. Yeah. So six or seven deload. Yeah, it's been like seven. Yeah, so feel feel fucking good, man. Feel strong, feel explosive, nice and snappy, nice and loose. Uh, get some sparring later. So it's nice to have this little like deload type session right now. Feel nice and springy. But I guess it'd be similar to a fight because the morning of a fight is yeah, like. Yeah, exactly. Well, I was feeling better than it came in. Yeah. That's kind of the point. Keep yeah. things snappy, keep them light. Yeah. Stay injury free. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. First thing I notice whenever I'm overtrained is my thoughts. Yeah. Like my thoughts are way more like depressive. Really? Not not depressive like I'm sad, I want to kill myself, this mm -hmm. that. It's just like I have a rain cloud. Like everything's just a little bit more gray. Yeah. And like that's like the biggest telling sign to my overtraining. Mm -hmm. And like nothing has changed from yesterday to today besides the fact that I actually fucking rested. Yeah. And it was the first complete rest day since last week but the beginning of this week was a lot of volume so it's just it's crazy like as soon as my body starts like my cns gets fucking waxed yeah, it's my that mind that gets like discouraged before anything like that just get 100 like on edge it's crazy it's, it's, it's central nervous system fatigue it just brings everything down Shut i get like, slow like my what thoughts you, yeah dude. i get slower like my thoughts i can't like so you have to step back from, yeah i just lost like half a step yeah. i just like that's what do you take for that now do I take yeah, I'm taking Ashwagandha and um, there's one more that's good for for overtraining. I can't think of what it is. I can't even think of what it is. What do you think of the sleep and nutrition and after that? And then you go, yeah, Ashwagandha is fine, magnesium is fine. Magnesium, I think. Like normal, like sleep, anything like that. Yeah, I slept like, I went to bed like 9 o'clock last night. I was hoping for something like that. Program's live now. Uh, link in bio, or yeah, check my link in bio. What's the what's the code right now? Chicken uh, dash legs twenty. Chicken dash legs. No, chicken dash yes. legs all caps. Chicken dash legs all caps <laughs> for twenty percent off. This is gonna run until uh, December first. December, December first. Yeah. Oh, this is Coach Chicken Legs, by the way. <laughs> this is who I'm working on this program with, or who actually did the whole program. Yeah, I've been working with them for like. Two years now, it's sick. Check the program, chicken, dash, legs, all caps, 20% off. Link in bio, let's go. That's a hard sparring tonight, dude. Um, we did 10 rounds with Toka Khan over there. He's over there. He's uh, he's headlining the CES boxing show. Was I think at Foxwoods. Foxwoods, Mohegan. Oh, well, I think it's Fox, Mohegan. Foxwoods, Mohegan, he's headlining the show. Uh, really good boxer in this area. We're gonna get some. Some hard rounds and I'm excited, man. Probably, probably ten, at least eight, probably ten. Though. Let's go. Let's go. How do you approach boxing sparring, even though you're in an MMA fight? Like, what do you? Because you can't. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, I fight bare knuckle and I'm and I'm sparring with 16 ounce gloves. So I guess when I'm doing my boxing sparring, boxing sparring, I'm I'm much more prioritizing like my footwork, uh, because I guess the name of the game in the MMA stuff would be like try not to get hit as often. So you try to dance around much more. So I try to keep that in perspective when I'm when I'm moving in here and not get caught in like stupid high pocket exchanges or high guard exchanges because that's not really like a realistic thing. Uh, so like touching and moving, touching and moving, and just staying on my bike really. Uh, but Toka's in shape now. I know it's good, really good southpaw explosive. So it's gonna I'm gonna test my gas tank tonight. It's gonna be good. Bro.
Coming on five. Doing good, bro. Let's go. Smile. Let's go. It's super fun time. Ten rounds, ten hard rounds. Uh, Thirty seconds off between each round. Ten straight, me and Toka. Uh, yeah, dude, we're we're both in really good shape right now. We push the pace. Oh, this guy was good fucking work, man. He's fighting November two, Foxwoods on the fifteenth uh, in Biloxi. He's fighting at 135 pounds. I'm fighting 135 pounds. He's a super fast, uh, fast twitch lefty. That was good, man. Was on my bike for, for ten for all ten rounds, pushing the pace, moving, fighting with my feet behind my jab. That was that was a good session, man. I can't wait. I can't fucking wait to fight, bro. I'm ready to go.